Hello and welcome to Regrow Tech India. I'm your host, Dure Nayab, bringing to you yet another question on races. Let's get on the screen and see the question. So the question reads, A and B takes, a, takes part in a 100 meter race. Okay. A runs at 5 kilometers an hour. A gives B a start of 8 meters and still beats him by 8 seconds. The speed of B is what? Okay. Now, first things first. Let us understand what do you mean by A gives B a start of 8 meters. So, if A is giving B a start, meaning A will complete the entirety of 100 meters, whereas B, A will start at 0 and go to up to 100. Whereas B will start at 8 meters and go up to 100, meaning B will only be covering 92 meters. Okay. Now, we need to find B's speed. Okay. Now, B's speeds, uh, the speed of B, right? Chalo. So, B's speed is nothing but whatever is B's distance divided by B's time. Okay, this is what we need to calculate. Now, first of all, how much distance is B is covering? We can uh, say it from here, it goes from 8 to uh, 100. So, a B is covering a distance of 92. Directly, we have discussed as to why. Because A is giving a start to B of 8 meters. So, B is only covering 92 meters. Then, what is B's time? This can be a little tricky because B takes 8 minutes extra from what A took. So if we can calculate A's time, we will just add 8 to this. Okay. Now, we how can we calculate A's time? So A's time is what? Simply distance by speed. Now speed for A is given as, as 5 km per hour. Convert it into meter per second first. So 5 multiplied by 5 upon 18. Let's keep it as 25 upon 18 for now. Okay, therefore, and I'm just going to calculate A's time is equals to 100 divided by, which is distance divided by speed, 25 upon 18 kilometers per hour. So 25 ones are 25, 25 fours are 100. 18 times four is about 72 seconds. So, A is going to cover or A is going to complete or cover the distance of A 100 meter in 72 seconds. Now, we know according to the question, B is taking 8 seconds more, meaning B's time is going to be 28. Okay. So, if you can calculate this, we will get uh, B's speed and this will get it in meter per second. But if you see, the answer is in kilometer per hour. So, what is the method of calculating uh, meter per second into kilometer per hour? All you need to do is multiply this with 18 by 5. Right? So, let's go ahead and solve that. Where, from where did 28 come? 80, right? I am so sorry. So, let me just quickly explain how B's time is 80. Uh, because B took 8 seconds more than what A took. A took 72, 72 plus 8. So this is going to be 80. For some reason, I had written 28. So please don't mind me. I can get a little forgetful. Okay. So let us solve this further. So we will have, uh, if we see, 2 nines are 18, 2 fours are 8, then uh, 2 twos. 2, 4 is 8, 2, 6 are 12, 10, and then 23. 23 multiplied by 9 is 23 multiplied by 10 is 230 minus that. So it will be 207 divided by 50. Right? If you calculate this, I think you'll get 4.14 kilometers per hour. And that should be your answer. I hope that is understood. Uh, if you want me to take up any more questions, put them on the comments. Other than that, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.